we will never forget them, nor the last time we saw them this morning as they prepared for their journey and waved goodbye and slipped the surly bonds of earth to touch the face of God. On January 28, 1986, the Space Shuttle Challenger broke apart 73 seconds into its 10th mission, resulting in the death of all seven crew members. This mission had already been postponed several times due to mechanical problems and bad weather. Temperatures dropped below freezing the night before. Throughout the morning, engineers expressed concern because the shuttles had never launched in such extreme conditions. However, at 11.38 a.m., Challenger was cleared for launch. After the disaster, the shuttle program was shut down and a complete investigation ensued. Grief turned to anger as it was discovered there was gross negligence to launch that day. The relationship of O-rings and cold temperatures was known. It was concluded that cold weather caused the failure of an O-ring, a rubber gasket, and the right rocket booster. It leaked flames that ignited the external fuel tank. After the loss, it took NASA almost three years to redesign, rebuild, and get confident about going into space again. Shuttle flights resumed in September 1988. I'm Mark Mancuso.